want to go to high school, but rest, they went back home because parent thinks, their, their parents think, you know, it's better to stay at home and help the house chores. So it is not successful, but at least we could help some, you know, lives. So what I want to do, women's graduation. for our souls. And <coughs> I bet that this banana, there are so many things and the, the, the uh, legacy that Dr. Carmen mentioned, uh, maybe for all countries we are coming from, we do have such a movement. Can stop violence, can stop war, can do a lot, even if she does not. <laughs> from all over the world or Europe uh, this moment to do to take decisions and I think in this uh, uh, re resolution or uh, the final uh, paper must express our willingness to work harder how to stop such is, uh, such uh, um, situations in many parts of the world not only the uh, selling uh, uh, young girls but the forced marriage, the forced rape during the war or conflict situations that exist and we, we, don't, we don't see them. We listen, we hear about yeah. wars in some parts yeah. of the world, but we don't uh, realize the effect on women. And I believe we should do something, and this is to address the leadership of the world. We have United Nations, 
that is the umbrella that could do support, and they do uh, a lot on this issue, but you have to go to uh, leaders of each country that uh, they accept, they, um, they, they don't uh, oppose to such, uh, or try to change education, decisions, legislations, to change these uh, habits, these uh, traditions. And we have to do something, and we must do. In Cyprus, uh, I was a member of the parliament, and I was chair of the committee for refugees and claimed missing persons. And I raised the issue of the women raped in 1974 by the Turkish army, and of course, by some fascists of raping uh, Turkish Cypriot women. We have to face this issue. We have to put, and not feeling embarrassed, uh, especially the women, and not uh, all of us, that, that this happened. Yeah. We should go to the leaders of each country that accept the, the violence, the rape, the sexual violence generally during the war. We cannot just accept that, yes, we have this, we make statistics. United Nations, you know, besides the, the resolution 1325, there are another six resol resolutions, uh, especially for the sexual violence during the war. So we have to do something, and we must demand punishment of the leaders of uh, countries that are involved in war, and they uh, accept or uh, leave their uh, army or, or others to use this method to uh, punish the enemy or any way to expose uh, the enemy. We have a lot of things to say, and you know when, because uh, I spoke, I managed to make women that were raped in 1974 to speak in secretly, of course, so to me, but I managed to give them some support, enough to live a better life, but they don't speak all of them. I spoke with around 70 women, and uh, whenever I start thinking of this issue, I also start crying because to listen to 70 women about what happened to them, although 45 years ago, they still feel um, all the trauma that uh, they uh, that they, they they put in here deep uh, of their heart for so many years, and it's not enough just to mention them. We have to do something, and it's the only way. Otherwise, it's just resolutions, uh, nice uh, decisions, nice uh, romantic uh, dreams. We have to demand punishment of the leaders of countries that they accept sexual violence during the war. Thank you. Thank you very much. I'm sure that these are absolutely very important subjects, and I'm sure there are still more things to say. We could stay all night and talk. I'm afraid we will have to stop here. Uh, we will um, soon conclude this session. And uh, I, before we conclude, um, I would like to um, invite uh, our international president, our European president, to give some uh, awards to <laughs> our panelists. So if you would like to. Uh... So for this session, we had uh, um, not only, uh, only the, the three present panelists, but also Madame Lapidi. And uh, Mrs. Um, Feza is going to represent her to receive her award. If you would like to take place.